Welcome back to this. Guess where we're going today? Guess what you're not seeing? Me climbing up here. We showed that in the last video, so it's not required. Still don't know what this star is, but pretty sure I we're going like to find out in this video. Abuse. Yep, agreed. Okay, straight away, I said in the last video I was going to try and do this without safe state, so... Here we go. Such riveting gameplay, honestly. You're going to need to get like four or five firsties in a row like me. Yeah, well, exactly. Even if I get this without dying, then, like, I'm not convinced that it's more of a feat than what you did, <laughs> frankly. <laughs> so far, I've only got, like, one first. I'm not trying to get them. I'm actually, like, intentionally pressing it a little bit later. I think you've got, like, f I think it's, like, four or maybe five frames. I can't remember. I think it may be five that you can actually wall kick after, like, before he'll just fall. So, like... With that knowledge in mind, it probably is actually safer to delay it a little bit and increase your chances of actually getting a wall kick, but yeah, made it safe state going yeah. down. Yeah, well, listen, uh, this ain't my first rodeo, son. I've played this game before. <laughs> you need to remember that. And I'm not getting in the pipe, not yet anyway. Probably try and do, do 100 coins. That. Okay, I'm in the same kind of... I wonder how many people you... oh. out there are going to remember that from Hold on. when you streamed it. Yeah, and also my 2018 playthrough, which wasn't uh, televised like this. Okay. Well, the hard part of the stage is over. He lied. Honestly, gonna go I, I, for coins? I'm going to go for coins. I might as well give me a chance to like get used to the stage. Coins and red coins in the stage seem like they're going to be especially brutal. Yep. The red co I mean, it depends how many coins there are, right? But the fact that the red coins are everywhere doesn't make me feel great. I, know I can't one... explain why, but I have this foreboding oh, feeling that this is going to be one of those stages that has very little over 100 coins. Like it's gonna be Yeah, I, I, I get that impression as well. Also, look at this. It's death sand, but it's on a wall, so I guess you can just touch it and it's... It's fine. Why wouldn't it be fine? Is there anything higher than me? There's really only one. I think there's just that out. star that I got. I think that was it. I can't. I know, but I don't know if there's like a cheeky red coin up there. So, well, that ain't gonna work. I'll just jump. Yeah, good call. Can't be too careful with this fucking game. Yep. The music's not too bad. I mean, I don't really care for it, but it's not like in your face like many of the previous levels. I didn't see that there. Like, I actually thought uh, that was further away than it was. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of this. Okay, it's I'm honestly pleasantly surprised with how well my first episode in here went, and I actually yeah. have to show off some skill for a change. <laughs> There's been plenty of skill from both of us in this playthrough, and also plenty of stuff that you couldn't really describe as skill, to be honest. It's been uh, challenging, I think. Which is just a PC way of saying that like, we've been pretty bad in a lot of places, both of us. Yeah. Like I'm listen, I'm still thinking about level eleven. Like I can't stop thinking about it. When I was so I wasn't practicing off screen but I was faffing about in the overworld, I fell off the cloud and landed in the pipe. <laughs> Honestly, I wasn't even trying. You can't escape. No, I can't. Oh, there's a red coin down there. Is this gonna make it? Oh, I wonder if this is the other star actually. No, it's not. At least I managed to grab all of those. Yep, okay, I'll just grab this. Have a look behind this. See things, then do it, and then see the thing that I'm doing as I'm doing it. And there you go, the winning formula. That's pretty I'll much be honest, what this series Even has been. though, like, getting into this stage. Nope. It's fucking awful. I get less dread from this than I did from stage 11. Oh my god, honest. yeah, like, uh, agreed. But. Like, not gonna lie, some of that shit I did in my episode previous to this was really bad. I was less stressed doing that than I was trying to do shit in Course 11. Yeah. And also, the Steel Bowl probably did help a bit. Oh, absolutely. I felt a new sense of confidence in myself. 
because it's pretty much like playing on a brand new stick, isn't it? And it's always going to feel like that now. Honestly, those guys are doing the Lord's work. We need they more really like are. that in life. I specifically mean more people making steel sticks. <laughs> we need more of that. Like, I knew it was going to feel fantastic and I was really going to like it. I still can't prepare you for the pure euphoria you feel when you actually get to take yeah. it out for a spin. Oh, Even absolutely. in this game. I was online as his waiting list for like two and a half years and see when I finally got that email saying your numbers come up, I can't tell you, it was like winning the lottery in a way it was, kind of a lottery in a way. Yeah, no kidding. Really not a fan of this, uh, seems like I might not be able to really get all of these unless I like, go up really high and long jump down maybe, every time. Should I do that? Obviously the answer that block is with the secret on it right there, you might be able to do it, yeah. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I think... Mm, I'm not sure about the top one. Let's just see what we can do. I mean, okay, no, that's obviously unacceptable. Probably don't really need all of them, but... If I can yeah, just grab some of them... Better it's, fucking hope not. It's because, yeah, it, like you were saying, like I, I don't know how many coins are in this stage. I get the feeling that it's not a massive amount. So... Okay, these aren't much better. They're a little better. A uh, little bit. Not much. I don't like this. See, I, I could accept that, but I know I can get both of them doing that exact same thing, so... Christ, maybe I can't. Maybe I'm uh, overestimating my abilities here. Yeah, do you know what? We'll just we'll take it. It's fine. We're already at 59, and... As I mentioned previously, I think uh, going for all coins might be out of the picture. Oh, by the way, you're going to have to go to that really terrible no, walking section in front of you to get a red coin, just so you and then, know. And then I'm going to have to come back, because the, the red coin spawn location is in this part of the stage, isn't it? Yeah. I don't want to talk Difficulty, about it. Difficulty, quote-unquote. Yeah. Difficulty, quote-unquote, the hack... That's what that says. There's not even a fine line between difficulty and, like, terrible level design. Yep. Like, it's a pretty broad line. And... Oh, he's clearly on one side of it. It's... I'll leave it as an exercise to the viewer to figure out which side. Now, is there anything back here? Good thought. Again, never be too careful. I mean, I feel like I need... No. We're not going to do that. I was going to try and get over there again doing that same thing, but I don't think there's actually... But then again, there's always a chance. There could be something here, and I don't want to miss it. There isn't. Great. No, you can't really survive that, so... Is there anything behind me? I just never know. Skill. Always yep. getting punished for skill. Back to the snow pipe. Definitely has business being here. I suppose we are pretty high up, so maybe it's just really cold. I don't want to do a tally for how many times we feel we were punished for being skillful in this game, but that oh would my God. require yeah. work. Don't know if there's enough numbers. <laughs> so yeah, there's you... like two secrets and at least one red coin over there, which is dumb. You skimmed over this in your video. It says something. Oh, this... Yeah. Can you tell what it says? Maybe that should be another All exercise I... left to the viewer. The only words I can make out are biggest dick. That's all I'm going to say. And with that point made, let's just move on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I remember you had some trouble with an invisible wall here. Let's... Yep. Okay, well, clearly I'm a, a little bit luckier than you today. What? <laughs> Wow, I have no not. comment. No it's words. Not. Nothing. Don't question it. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, we haven't been over there yet, have we? Oh, wait a minute. That's the start. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah. It's just it's strange. Like, we, we've, we haven't been up at this part, though, have we? No, we haven't. No. And I can see a sniffer up there as well. And, and 
possibly a second one. How much or, you want to bet there's a red coin up there somewhere? Oh, no, I have been up there. I've been at this part, at least, because that's how I got onto that thing. But I don't think I've been to this side. And yeah, you're probably right. There probably is a red coin. In fact, I feel like I should go and check that now. There's probably well, a red coin. At least a secret, possibly a panel. Oh, come on. Be reasonable. You know all three are definitely there. He's, he's so generous. I, I can't deny it. Yeah. Hold on, that's just the... Yeah, I've been on there already. Right, safe state going down. When I'm miles away from where I need to be, clearly. No, I'm, I'm going to just uh, try and get all the coins that I see from now on. I need this guy to come back in first. This is reminding me of level 8. God, I missed that stage. Remember that one sniffer that was like... There? Constantly ruining your business. I just wanted to see if there was anything in that, so... I wonder if you can make this without having to do that extremely cursed movement. Seems you had to do it anyway. No, there's no way you can make that. There's absolutely no way. Look at this. I'm kind of shocked that no, Sponio had knowledge of this technique, because this one feels kind of obscure. It's a little bit out there. Uh, I know when I was playing this in 2018, I think I had to look up how to do this, because I, I hadn't come across this trick before then. Is there anything in this one? No. Imagine if there was coins in that, and then, like, when you were doing all coins, you had to, you had to get them. Uh, that would be horrendous. That would be horrendous, and therefore I completely expected it. And I'm surprised it wasn't the case. Getting a little bit worried about the coin count, not gonna lie. It just seems very Same. low, doesn't it? It does. I see that death sand. I see it. So how the fuck do you go over there? I mean, I've got an idea and I don't like it. Can you guess what it is? Oh, wait a minute. Man. Maybe you can just long jump over this, actually. I had an idea that was very stupid, which was to do, like, the slow thing along that wall, but actually I think that might be too low. Like, the wall's near the beginning, I mean. Okay. Yeah. Let's just get into position here. Safe state going down. Oh, alright. Okay, this is clearly a lack of two jamboree, so... Oh, no. I, I feel like I probably should try that again. Why risk I just, it at this point? I, I know, like, we've come so far. So... Don't you do that. Thanks for not doing it. Oh, do you know what? I'll take it. Can't wait to get 99 coins and be stuck. It's gonna happen. Oh, there's yet another Lakitu. I told you, it's a Lakitu Jamboree. Clearly we need to use this to do something which, you know... One of the boffins can figure out. I wonder if somebody in the comments is going to see that. Why we? I, I see what that. Fucking course. Uh, right, well, fucking course. I'm we're going. We're going to get it now. I'm not going to say I'm glad I directed your attention here, but I'm glad we didn't miss this one because this would be a pretty obvious one to miss. Yeah. Did you like that camera spin I did in mid earlier? And still didn't fall. That was fall. A... It was a That's cheeky camera nice. spin, yeah. I actually did one earlier in the stage, I don't know if you caught it. Just no, showing off, just showing off a little bit. Okay, well there's two out of three. The panel here too. Let me just put a state down. Can I actually get over here? I reckon this is probably the, there. that must be the other star, right? The ball kicks one. It has to be. Is this, surely <laughs> this isn't what you're meant to do. You just long jump off of the panel maybe? Does that give you the height? Uh, I don't think so. I think it's too far away. Uh, I, I, I think what I'm doing can work if it's angled correctly. Like that. Yep, there you go. Okay, that's got to be what it is, isn't it? It must be, because the other ones are secrets, panels, and red coins, so... Yep. How many red coins have I got? Don't know, because the pause screen doesn't tell you. And I wasn't I paying attention. Like four. I think I think it's about four, but... I... Yeah. Let me just put a state. I'll come back up and get a star later on. I'm obviously going to get 100 for now, so let's just see where we are. I think I'm to probably... To finish my thought, I wonder if 
someone in the comments is going to question why you and I would go so far as to preserve an old controller when, you know, there are other methods we could use to, you know, use well, controllers like, with an emulator. Oh, well, yeah, you could play with a keyboard. <laughs> Keyboard, you can use other controllers, you know, like an yeah, Xbox controller. Yeah, or... PS4 controller on BizHawk or something. Yeah. No, surely no one's going to do that, right? No one's going to do that. I don't know anyone that would do Nobody that. Nobody would. Do you? I certainly don't. I mean, unless you like playing with eight directions. Because I tried to play DK64. <laughs> there you go, quota met. How far? I know, only 15 minutes. Uh, I tried to play <laughs> that on BizHawk once, and it was literally eight directions with an N64 controller. Like, can you believe it? Have you ever heard something so ridiculous? Like, that might be the only way to make that game worse, and it did it. So, congratulations. Might actually try and get some more of these coins. Although, I couldn't get them the first time, which makes me think I probably can't get them now. Well, if I do have four coins, four red coins, uh, that means there's like four left, which is eight, which brings me to what, 97? Oh no. Yep. Does that mean I need to get these three? Well, maybe I should try, just in case, you know. That's a horrifying thought, but I don't disagree. I, I, I don't even know if I can, like, like, maybe get one of these? Oh, or, or just get both of them. Or just do them both. Right. I think this one's in oh. a pr pretty bad location, but I feel like with some ridiculous wall kicks, it should be survivable. Probably would need first Yeah, I should just give you the controller, you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, surely I can just do this, right? Yeah. Why didn't I think of that before? Why was I doing all this triple jump nonsense? Anyway, we've got enough now. By the way, I should say that I feel like I've collected every coin in this stage, except for one from a lack of two that I let I fall off. So my, my sense of dread, my sense of dread is rising. Mines has been maximized for a few episodes now. Guess what level caused that? God. Really feel oh, quite it. quite strongly that that wasn't my fault. That's all right. You know what? It's fine. Who you know, cares? Let's try to talk about pleasant things while we're grasping at straws looking for fucking coins. <laughs> yeah. Have um, we checked in here yet? So I feel, feel like you and I are the kind of the same when it comes to this. Um, I like actual hardware, but I'm less picky about that versus an emulator. Um, as opposed to, say, controllers. I'm way more picky about controllers. Yeah, I'm exactly the same yeah. as you. I'm, I, listen, I never play on console anymore. Like, never, because it, it's too much effort and I'm just too old and lazy now. Like, I'll literally just... Now that Simple 64 exists, I mean, that was the like the final frontier, really, wasn't it? N64 emulation, yeah. and it's, it's kind of over the line now, at, at long last. So, I've got a good controller. I've got a GameCube controller as well, you know, a PS2. I've got adapters for all of them, so, you know what, if I never have to leave my desk to play a game, then I'm happy. Yeah, I've got adapters for everything important. I need to get a new one for GameCube, because I've got a shitty Mayflash adapter, Oh, but that's the oh. only one that I need to get a new one for. Yeah, obviously you're going to want to go with Rafnet, as always. Oh, absolutely. Been Actually, those for years, they're the best, by far. Yeah, I, I'm picky. I like using the actual controller. I feel weird and off if I'm not using it. It just doesn't feel right to me. That should have... Same. I know. I, I, it's okay. I know what happened there, so you know what? It's fine. That's what work. It's like back in the day, and I've bitched about this before, but it annoys the hell out of me. Like back in the day when I was first getting into emulation, back, actually, back circa oh, no. 2003, Showing your age so it's there. definitely been a while. But there were always, like, people in forums complaining about trying to find, like, adequate controls. And my favorite was once Super Mario World ROM hacks became a thing, which they were pretty much already a thing at that point. Um, people who didn't grow up with Mario World would bitch about the controls, and then you ask them, oh, well, maybe I can help you figure out a better, like, setup, or what's your setup, maybe I can offer some insight, make your experience better. And they'd always drop the bomb that they were using either... For the most part, it was always an Xbox 360 controller, and in 2003, you know, 
Well, back then it would be like at the keyboard or Xbox. Yeah, it would have been keyboard, you definitely, know. or some like PC controller. But a few years later, you used to always hear Xbox 360 controller. And if you know anything yeah. about those, you know that the D-pad is a piece of literal shit. It's one button. It's one button, the D-pad, on a 360, isn't it? It's yep. one disgusting it's, button. Essentially. Yeah. It's like... I feel like it's invalid to complain about the controls when you're using probably the worst possible controller to control said game. Yeah, agreed. Also, uh, I thought there would have been a way over there. Turns out not. So I guess I need to go to. back to the pipe. Oh yep. Okay. That's fine. No one can prove that I'm actually annoyed, so I, I'm not. Speaking of, I have a friend, and this is entirely true. Uh, when they first played Super Metroid years ago, they didn't have... And by years ago, I mean probably like 10 years ago, something like that. They didn't have any controllers oh. for PC. No. So they played through Super Metroid, a Super Nintendo game that requires some pretty precise motion on a keyboard. Uh, my hands hurt just thinking about that. I've never played that game. I've actually never played any Metroid game, including the Prime games. Super Metroid is excellent. It's really good. Um, I'm also a huge fan of um, Metroid Zero Mission, which is the GBA remake of the first game. It's Honestly, might be my favorite 2D Metroid experience. It's really, really good. But Super is like way up there. Might even be tied. Yeah, I'll need to try it one day so I can finally understand the save the animals thing. I'm sure it's hilarious. Uh, we've been around this stage, God knows how many times. I think I'm actually going to have to go through this gauntlet again, like to get back to where the pipe is. Yeah, you had to go to that really garishly coloured area with the that I had to do the first time. So yep. There's a couple red coins there and at least one secret. So I'm gonna have to go there and then come back to get the the red coin star. What fun. Probably even more coins in general over there. You know what? Let's uh Well, did you see any when you were there? Because I didn't. There might have been like an enemy or something, that's about all I can think Oh about. yeah, true, maybe. Just to make it a little bit extra annoying, you know. Oh, okay, this clearly wasn't the full way up, so... Nope, it can't ever be a simple track. No, everything must be as long and difficult as possible. Not to mention tedious. Yep, and if you've got a problem with that, it just means you're bad at the game, clearly. So we must just be really bad at this. Yeah, we're the worst, Yep. Clearly. Okay. Can I land in the pipe? Of course I can. I'm actually surprised he didn't take damage from that though. You know, sometimes you can Dang. even when you land in a loading zone like that. So let me just have a quick look around, see if I can see a red. The reds that I remember are, are a bit higher up. Yeah, it seems like that might be the case. Okay. Let's just go as far as we can. Safe state going down again. Can't see how. I'm, you know what? I'm just going to jump. I'm not even going to faff about the long jumps. Probably best to go quite high and then, like, jump down to them, right? Like, that way at least I can see where they all are. Oh, okay. Didn't even mean to do that. This section gives me the cold sweats. <laughs> Oh, okay, Honestly. yeah. S same when things like that happen. I saw a box down there also, maybe there's coins in that. Same. There's another section that would look really nice TES, you know, just loads of firsties. I might seriously do that for that first section, just make like a really short TES. That'd be a fun bonus video. Yeah, well I'd probably just append it to one of these, actually, like, well it's... Relevant, you know. Oh my God, that's true. It probably wouldn't take very long. No, it wouldn't take me long at all. Like what, five minutes, something like that. What to make? Yeah, probably about that. Oh, good. There's a panel here too. I just saw oh, one. Of course. What else could he do? Oh, there's like, at least two panels because there's, there's... spread across the entire damn stage like this. Jesus. Like... Well, someone obviously never told Scalino that, so. It's not his fault. Someone should have told him. I mean, if they're done 
well, it's mostly fine, but they're, these things are meant to be like in like one or two well-defined areas. Yeah. They're not meant to be. A sub-area or something like that. That would be fine. The way it's been done in this game and... Not that sub-area that we did in that volcano stage, though. Oh my god. Yeah, do you know what? I I'd actually sort of somehow forgotten about that when I was talking about Course 11 giving me memories. Like, nah. <laughs> that might honestly be worse. I don't know. I don't that know. That one section is so, so bad. By the way, have you noticed the issue here? That was the seventh coin. Yep. So... I wonder if the eighth coin is... No, no, that's not what I mean. This. Look at my coin count. When I get the next one, I'm going to have 98 coins, so clearly I'd, no. uh, I, I had fewer coin, fewer reds than I thought I did. That, well, that, there I wonder must if be, this is one of those levels coins. where the coin count changes per star. You know what? I am not going to think about that for now. But there is that block down there. Maybe yeah, exactly. Points, yeah. It's the only the saving grace we have right now. The copium block. Oh, come off it. I completely made that. Where's that other red coin anyway? I haven't seen it yet. I was Probably hoping... on one of these openings, right? I was hoping there'd be another one in one of those openings. That's my only thought, because I haven't Could seen it? any others. You've been, been around the whole damn stage. Where did that pipe lead? Can you remember? The one that's, like, down Back there. Back to the grey area with the, the purple death force. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember now. I see that panel. I don't see a red coin so far. I don't want to have to levitate, you know? I, I, but sometimes I feel like maybe that would be the smart thing to do, just to see where it is at least. Well, let's just see if we can see I mean, it from we've here. We've proven many times that doing things the smart way just doesn't work in this hack. Yeah, true. Well, it's not a smart hack, so... don't really know what a smart hack is, to be honest. I just know that this is not one. Right, where is that <laughs> block that we saw? Did, did we definitely see a lower. block? Or was I just yeah, was uh, like, hallucinating again? I that was a block. I think yeah, it's much lower, though. It looked like one. Yeah, I saw it the other. Did you see it? It's like yeah, way down all there. down. Yeah, right. That can only possibly be coins unless it's a Japes block, right? It can only be. Or if a that's a Japes block, I swear to God. Do you know what? I'm just going to say it. See, even if this is a Japes block, I'm not going to find it funny. So... Is it truly a Japes block? I don't know. I think it is. Look how it is. I can't think of anything else it could be. Oh, thank God for that. Okay, so at least we've got this out the road. So you'd Going have for all. If you hadn't missed two. Going for all coins in this stage would be really, really bad because of that. Like that's so easy to like. You'd have one hundred seven because you missed one coin from that block and one from the lack of two, and plus the two from the red coin you're missing. You'd have about one hundred nine. Yeah, that sounds right. Where the hell is this coin, though? I, I bet we've like went past it before, and I just um. That's blind. what I fear. Yeah. But... Now, can you see it? There's also the possibility it. that it's back in the other area somewhere, and you know, I've just had a repressed memory come to the surface. I just, that, that was me tapping the levitate code, don't mind that. Oh, great, my camera's fucked. His head's fucked, look. <laughs> in fact, uh, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll finish what I was saying in a minute, but uh, actually I'm going to have to load the save state again, because it's, it's screwed now. But if I do this, right, and then levitate out of it, <laughs> now he's stuck with this. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's perfect for the rest of this. I feel like we should finish... Uh, the level like this. I might actually do that. This is, this <laughs> yeah, is how I feel at all jump. times oh playing God. this. Yeah, but as I was saying, I, I, I feel like a repressed memory has just come to the surface and the red coin might be on that clock over there, like as in against it. But I, I'm, I'm struggling to understand how you would get that and survive. So do you know what? I'm actually just going to let you over and check. to the top and do that trick where... Possibly, but where would you land? I suppose you could land back down there, right? Mario's long jumps look amazing with his fucking head crooked like that. It's so funny. Yeah. 
I just nope. want to check this to avoid like waste. Also, possibly on this now, it's just to avoid wasting so much time, you know, because the level is just needlessly big. It is. Is it on this side? Is there anything on this side? No. Is there a point to us playing this game? Not really. Look at this. He's like punched through his head. This is the most entertaining part of the stage. True. It's not going to be at the beginning, right? Surely not. Surely big, not. So here's my problem. This is a big open stage. Red coins render at any distance. So how the fuck have we not seen it yet? Maybe we yeah, that's there. They render at any I'm distance as long as there's like nothing in the way. So like the fact that it could be behind one of those things over there. Although saying that, they are sort of look at them just stopping existing and coming back in like that. But this is actually good because it'll let us know if it's actually in that area, right? If I go far yeah. away enough. Okay, didn't mean to do that. Right, now. Oh my god. Oh, he's so slow. I'm not seeing one over there, thankfully. Me neither. Oh, I think I'm at the boundary. I'm at the boundary. Alright, head over this way. I'm not seeing one either. Oh. Hold on, what? I think I saw it. Go back. Oh no, wait, that was that old star. I thought I nah. saw one up at the top of that bit, but no, that's that old star that I got. Is, is there hard another one that's yeah, it's very hard to tell? And I'm pretty sure we've probably gone past it a million times already. Yeah, if one of you in the audience has seen the red coin, um, tell us, send us a letter. Yeah, middle, yeah, the like carry a pigeon. Yeah. Um, because you know we're, we're totally not recording this whole thing before any of it goes live. Definitely not. What if it's? Do you see those panels over there? Those ones that lead up really high. That doesn't actually been... narrow it down. What you mean over? Oh my god. Okay, well I can't go into first person mode anymore because I've done this so you'll just have to tell me what you mean like over here yeah they're up high from where you are there's like a group of like three or four panels yeah no that just I, I went on those it, it led over to that okay. large uh thwomp just wanted to make See? sure yeah i don't uh, fucking know i legitimately don't fucking know me neither i mean it's still possible it's in that area with the like over there i'm gonna go and have a quick look just I feel like if it's going to be somewhere, it's probably going to be over here, and I've probably just missed it. I will say, I'm awfully glad I didn't decide to do this, Star, because I almost did. Yeah, once again, you've managed to dodge a bullet, but it's okay, you'll get your comeuppance one day in the next level when you're it's doing the 100 point star. very unintentional, because I'd actually considered doing it just because, and then. Yeah, well, you made the right choice. It would seem. Right, can we see it? Not on this side. Oh, see a secret. So, the other thing I'm thinking is it might just be in between two of these walls. You know what I mean? Like, you've got oh, to get it God, yeah. whilst your wall kicking. Like, I mean, he's done that, other things like that. that. Look at Mario. I know, I know. He's just going so bloody slow. But yeah, honestly, we've, we've certainly seen that many times in this hack, so I wouldn't be surprised. Now, can we see it here? Especially in that fucking nope. pyramid level I did. That was where can it was we at its worst. Here? Nope. No. Can we see it here? That's, sh that's a shadow. Do you see that shadow? Yeah. Is that not just for the pipe, though? Or the, the block that's... Uh... Yeah, you might be yeah. right. Although, looking for a... Sh yeah. You know what? We should have just done that. We should have looked for a shadow, because... Uh... Well, if it's, like, over something, then... Like, over a pit, then... Yeah, it would be there. You know what? Let me just look the safe state again. I, there is one area that I haven't really checked properly. I mean, I did briefly go on it, but it's this area here. You know, just in case I, I somehow missed it. No, I, but I don't think there is. But there is that, that middle section over there. That's all I got. Yeah, I went in this, though. You mean these? I went through these. I mean, the Remember one past the piece switch, like that little... Where it looks what, like you can wall kick over there. Oh, but that's not oh I've, I did this. I, I, wall, I actually got back up by wall kicking here. Can't see. It's not going to just be like here and camouflaged against this present, is it? 
Okay, that dive is pretty majestic too. Hmm. Nah, it's not here. I can't I'm wait. Enjoying this running. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good look for him. Could it be? Could it be down here actually? Now what? There was one over this, wasn't there? I already got that. I suppose it could be in the other pit. Did we look inside here? It's like here? that oh. thing you can do in um, this Mr. One. Ninja starting going on, on N64. During the cutscenes where you summon the giant robot impact, uh, when he does his pose, you can like quickly rotate the control stick and his head will spin around like mad and you can make it bounce. <laughs> it's, it's very silly and I have to do it every time. Nice. I get to those cut yeah, scenes. of course, yeah. Yeah, I still need to play that game. I know you rate it, so I'm sure it's good. It's, it's one of my favorites on the N64, and it, uh, I discovered it by pure happenstance. I just I rented it one weekend because I couldn't think of anything else to rent, and I'd been it was one I'd I'd seen multiple times. Thought I should check it out. And the first time I played it, I'll fully admit I thought it was weird as fuck, and I didn't know if I'd get into it. But after I played it for a while, it did click. And then from then on, it was just like, yeah, no, I love this game. It's delightfully quirky. Yeah, it does look uh, pretty fun. I wonder if it's just like there's a fake bit in the snow. Surely not. That's that's a bit far even for this this game. Can you go inside the bottle? Maybe. Doesn't look like it. Mm -hmm. I don't see any coin inside the bottle anyway. So, is it on the books? Wait a minute, is it going to be inside one of these things? Oh my god. Could that I don't be I think it? so, those are just... Can't you break so? these though? No, mm. they're just spin blocks. What, they're the spin blocks from Super Mario. I know, I know, I, I know they are, but like, couldn't there still be something inside them though? I'm not sure if you can put something inside those. Possible? I'm going to check. I, I'm... I don't know that I've ever seen that done before, but it wouldn't hurt to check. Yeah, definitely not. I feel like you probably could, though, because you can fall through them, you know? So it's, it, it ceases to be a solid object once you hit them. This is true. Don't give Scalino any ideas for the sequel, though. <laughs> yeah, the sequel. When the hell's that coming out, Scalino? I'm waiting for it. Hold on a minute. Is it down here? You know... Yeah. That would have been a that good place for one. Well, I say a good place. A good place in so far as we've been able to find it. Not good in terms of actually collecting it. I mean, that would have been par for the course, something like that. Is there one just on this book that you can slide down? Nope. Wasn't ready. I was not expecting that. Uh, I think I'm pretty much out of ideas. I feel like I've checked everywhere at this point. I don't know how this would even be possible, but what if, what if there's only eight red coins on the eight red coin star? That would be unprecedented, although that means nothing in this hack. That sounds daft as fuck, yeah. but... I'm going to check this. Really I'm going to check this one more time, hack, right? So. Just, like, in here. I'm going to check it one more time, all the openings, because I feel like... If there's a thing, if there's a place that we've missed, it's most likely to be one of these, right? One of these openings, because there's like 14,000 of them. So let's just check them. If I can't find it, we'll probably just pause and off screen it. You know, in the interest of not boring Saving everyone to time, death. Yeah. yeah. He's going so slow, it's incredibly frustrating to deal with. <laughs> Still though, it's nowhere near as difficult as uh, some of the other stages we've done. It's frustrating in a different way. Yep. I, I, I feel like I definitely remember something to do with that coin, eh, that clock or that Bowser face thing over there, but maybe it's a false memory. Who knows? Yeah, I do not see any red coins here. I know you got two over here before. Camera really, really is uh, not not so great. I mean, some of that's my own fault for doing this stupid thing with the levitate code, which I'm now locked into because I've made a save state since then. So I can't like do Mario Cam without it doing like this. Look at him; his head's moving as I'm moving him. 
He's reacting with the control stick. I hope that doesn't fix his head. That would be unfortunate. Let's find out. No, it's just in a slightly different direction now. Okay, I'm out of ideas. We'll off screen this until we find the coin. So, I found out where the coin was. It's in a really bad location. It's under there, isn't it? Yes, it's it under is. it. And guess what? The cutscene's going to start. When I grab this. If I ever grab it. Oh my God. This is probably the worst possible situation. Yep. But like, I mean, come on, it's completely fair enough that we missed that, right? Oh my god. Well, I guess we're doing it again. I mean, how would you, why would, why? Why would you think to check it? I know. Fair. I mean, maybe like if you were like wall kicking across the front section, you might get like low down enough that you would see it, maybe, but my wall kicks were pretty decent on the way over, so that never happened. So I'm, I'm, I'm blaming my skill on why I didn't find that. Somehow that means that I win. I mean, we'll not Mario be analysing that. The crooked head is pretty satisfying, <laughs> though. Yeah, I mean, that's that why I'm intentionally screwing this up, so we can see it a couple of times. Unless someone can prove otherwise. Right, right you know what, fuck it, safe state. I don't want to do this again, so let's just... The good news is, uh, we're back in this area, which is kind of close to where the star spawns. Let's take a, take a break. Yeah, like I said, there's a pretty broad line between actual decent challenge and piss poor game design. Just leap to your imagination with that red coin wise. It is pretty funny how his head is flipping every time he does a kick. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of this. So, At least we know where that wall kick abuse thing yeah. is. Maybe I'll leave that one for the end as like dessert, you know? Oh yeah, shit. That's gonna be the... My god, I wasn't expecting him to hit it. I thought he was going to wall kick. So I, I fat fingered it. Which clearly is a phrase that I'm just saying all the time now. I think I've seen it like two or three times already in the last day. It's not even appropriate here. It doesn't even make sense. His head being like this is actually throwing me off a little bit. I know it sounds like John's, it honestly isn't though. Like I'm just used to seeing a normal head and it's uh, screwing my timing up. Anyway. The star's down here, isn't it? It's down around there somewhere. I wonder which one I should do next. God, spoiled for choice, you know? They're all so bad. Nice. <laughs> Hand right through the heat. Oh, and look where I bloody am. Am I going to get back up there? Absolutely not. Yeah, I'll get back up there legitimately. On difficult challenge and poor level design, poor game design. Just say I feel that like I'm going to. I think just for the rest of this level, I am going to do this nonsense though. Actually, let's change it a little bit this time. We'll do it like this, right? Yeah, now he's like, mm, that's not as funny. This this looks too Can natural. You, how about having him look straight down the whole time? Like he's holding his head in shame. Uh, I don't think I can now. I mean, he's turning it. Hold on, maybe if I do this. Hmm. Yeah, hold on. I don't know what I think of this. Uh, let me just load the safe state again. Oh, you're joking! All the way back here. Well, do you know what? Let's suffer together. We'll do it again. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't make another safe state. I guess I didn't think I would need one so soon, you know? There, so now we've got three stars instead of two. I mean, that's entirely fair. So. Yeah. Yeah, when you get back in there, you need to see how far like down you can put Mario's head. To I'll try that, but uh, it, this. yeah, if it doesn't look as funny, I'm, well, I'll do it for one of the stars at least. But for the other ones, I might just go back to how we did it there. That was pretty funny. Okay, safe state going down now. Right, so straight down. <laughs> yeah, fair. Look, little sad Mario. <laughs> He's fucking depressed. Yep, fair. 
completely fair. Look, his face is inside the block. <laughs> <laughs> this is very cursed. <laughs> right, okay, enough of this tomfoolery. Let's just get on with the, the task at hand. He's, he's literally just bashing his head every time here. I suppose if he did that, you might see the red coin organically here. Yeah, he can. But why would you he's do that? To, he's trying to forcibly remove the memories of this wall cake section from his mind. Yeah, whilst he's doing it. That's how efficient he is. I mean, if I fail this again, I'm like... I'll probably just start using save states during it. But... I thought I should at least try to get across... Oh look, you can kind of see that coin from where you are. Yeah, and that's because I fell down a lot at the beginning though. Like, as I say, if you just do like a normal jump or a long jump to start, it, it's going to be obscured, I think. I was going to say, it doesn't really excuse that coin placement. But... No, not at all. Don't you do it. Actually, maybe you should do it. Because I need to go here anyway. Okay, do it. Oh, alright, it's reset. You know what, we'll let him off for this section. I'll maybe change it back later. Just in case I need Mario Cam in here, you know? And, like, you kind of yeah, lose access fair. to that when you do that glitch. Okay. Didn't realise that was, uh, so close. So, I only saw two panels in this area. Neither were in great locations. I think just yeah, there's that one that's behind everything. I don't recall where the I think the second one's up high, maybe? It is up high, but I'm going to go up to the top and just see if we can see any others. Oh, you fucking... Bad words that I can't see on YouTube. Well, I've probably said them already before in this playthrough. Are you having fun yet, viewers? Don't answer because the answer's no. Makes the same mistake again, only like mirrored. God, that reminds me of the Wind Waker, and I will not be elaborating. If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't have to. These literally sound like the ramblings of a madman. Right, fuck it, safe stay going down. Let's try and minimize the duplication I mean, look of what's here. Front to any normal person's sanity. Yep. Once again, it lures you in by looking like it's like the circus or something. Yeah, see that? Did you see the switch there? This one, it's in the next section through there. Oh, yep. So, okay, well that doesn't seem too bad. It's not too bad, it's place. not in the in the worst spot. It's the other one that's going to be a problem. Well, yeah, if those are the only two, then, you know, fine. I can work with that. But I'm always, uh, after what happened in that other stage... Wait a minute though, what if this is like that... Level thirteen, where it, like, the panels only spawn on the. Oh god, I had I completely forgotten about that until you just brought it up. Yeah, I'm wondering should I just go for secrets? I think I'll just go for secrets because uh, that never happened with yeah, that. Yeah, I don't, I don't feel I, good. I don't feel good about that at all. It, surely he wouldn't do it to us again, right? God, no, we're not, we're not taking that chance. We'll just die from fall damage. Clearly, right? Did, that makes me want to double check all these because I. I that wasn't really looking for secrets when I came up here the first time. I'll just cheese this by falling down like this. I don't see any more in this section. Mm -hmm. uh, yep, nothing to say really. Did did I save state after I got that secret? Was it on this bit? I, I already can't remember. I don't remember either. I th I'm pretty sure I did. I think it was on this bit. Well, do you know what? We're just going anyway. 
If it's normal, I it out. It's like the most aggressively boring of the stage. I'm like, I, <laughs> I cannot. Yeah, it's giving me some uh, level 12 vibes, even though there was no like wall kick section in level 12. It was just aggressively boring. The most aggressively boring stage so far. It was level 12, wasn't it? That pyramid thing. Yep. That had some, probably some of the most egregious red coins yet. Yeah. Definitely. And also yeah, that another wing one. cap. Oh my god. That oh, fucking yeah, cap. Which I refuse, actively refuse to use. Like, who wants to feel like go up there possible. and get that? Like, you'd have to go up there and grab it, fall back down, probably take damage, and then try to get to where you need to go before the cap runs out. Like, that's just insane. Yeah, none of it's fun, but then again, you know, that's kind of this game, really, isn't it? I mean, would you say any part of this has been fun so far? First hub wasn't terrible. No, it was. Like it, it just, it, it just, it just means the stuff that came after was just worse. Like, let's be clear about that. The first hub was pretty bad. It was tolerable, and then after that, it all went downhill. See, I only think you think that in hindsight, like, because when you were doing like level three, you were not having a good time. No, I was not. And completely fair, because that level sucks. Once again, it lures you in. Where, like, whenever you see grass in a stage, you think, oh, it's going to be nice and easy. Nope. Okay. I can see one more secret over there. Is that all of them in this area? Maybe. I hope so. That'd be three. I feel like there's at least two elsewhere like that we've seen. Same. Also, I, That's a... I don't know that for a fact. Also, where's the secret star going to spawn? I get the feeling it's going to be in here. I don't find another pipe to spawn under like that red coin. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. I feel like I've just ended up back where I was a second ago. Don't you do that. Okay, so that's three. Should we just take the risk and... I think the rest of them are over just there. Have a quick look down here. I definitely remember seeing at least one. Yeah, I don't see any here. Yeah, it's... okay, fine. We'll just go for the pipe then. This is so unbelievably tedious, this section. I know. It is a bit tedious. It's just very repetitive as well. Come off it. Apparently, he took you some Donkey Kong 64, made it as repetitive as possible. Yeah, well, some people like that, I've been told, so, you know, who am I to judge? Alright, well, this section really sucks. The part that I'm in right now, is there going to be a secret? Oh, okay. Wait, why is it doing that now? Why is it doing that? I'm so confused. Yeah, I don't actually know why it's doing this, because I haven't done anything. Oh well, I guess we'll start with this head now. It's fine. Oh, okay, maybe not. You know what, if we're going to do this, let's just... I think it's going to... No, it's stuck. It's stuck. It's probably because I did it at the start of the stage, although the, the pipe... When I went through the pipe, it like visually reset it. Clearly still some nonsense is going on, so... I guess we're not going to be able to do anything in Mario Cam for a bit. You shouldn't really need it, anyway. I feel like I want to try and get it this way, since I, I told you to do this in the last episode, but I don't think I explained myself well. I mean, I got it, so... Yeah, yeah you just long jumped it, though, like, which is also why I did a minute ago. Well, several no, I didn't know tens of here. minutes ago. Did you? I might have to review the recording because I'm oh, pretty sure you didn't. That no 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 I didn't do that. Yeah. Right. Hmm. Should I do it the stupid way? Yes. Wait. Can I get up? Get up from here? Yeah, I can. I mean, like this next section, but I think I actually did this earlier. And you know what? Screw the stupid way. Well, maybe not, because I might actually have to if I can't even like get up here. Yeah. 
I feel like doing it the stupid way is actually easier. There's a secret over there. Uh, but before I, I grab that, out. yeah, before I grab that, I think there might be one in this area. You know, probably best to check. Probably should have been paying attention the last time we were here. <laughs> I was too busy trying to survive and make sure I had enough coins. I feel like I'm getting quite good at the timing for that. Maybe it's not one frame. I feel like it is, though. It definitely seems like it's very tight. Oh, it's definitely very tight. I just The question is, like, is it literally one frame? Because sometimes, like, a two-frame window is actually a lot easier to work with than a one frame when you're, like, trying to time something. Uh, this was a thing that came up in Majora's Mask speedrunning a number of years ago when they found, like, a way to, like, do like item duplication or bottle duplication in the curiosity shop and make it a two frame trick rather than a, a one frame trick by holding the R button or something to that effect. It's been a while. Is that no. one? No, not there. We would be able to see it from here because they'd end up from No, it's on, the, it's on the Blomp's head. It's next to the red coin in the block over there. I see it. Oh, well spotted. Alright, well we'll be going over here again later because guess what? There's fucking panels. Nope. What? Oh, I can explain. What? Let's just hope that doesn't happen again. That is some dumb shit. And that's a star, is it? No. Nope. No, the star's on top of that thing that we, where we just wear. Where's the star for this gonna spawn? Is it gonna be over here? Possibly. Okay, I can do something kinda stupid here, and I think I'm gonna try it. I'm not going to spend too long on it. You know what yeah, I'm going to do. I'm going to make this yeah. boring stage less boring. I'll take it. I don't think that's what you meant to do, but... Well, I meant to do a BLG, but... Uh, better than that, but you know what, it's fine. Anything to make the stage less boring, as you say. Well try it again. Gotta get something cool out of it. Yep. Oh, okay, that's what I remembered from earlier. <laughs> oh, what guess... Fuck, you oh, get that? Oh, I know how you get it. It's not good. I'll give you a hint, it's similar to the red coin, combined with the frame-perfect stuff to get over the death sand quickly. Well, not quickly, but survivably. Oh, no. Yep. I've already got ideas. Oh, I know I what the like idea. I know what we need to do. I'm just gonna see it. You need to like wall kick up to the top of that, and then do the trick on the top of the starting wall, the coloured bit, and then land in it. Unless you can, maybe you can actually do this in a slightly easier way. Actually, you might be able to just go all the way to the top again and just long jump to it as possible. I can't tell because I can't actually go into first person mode. So yeah, we'll just be going this way. <laughs> Safe state here. Let's do it on this side for a change. Okay, let's not do it on that side. See, this just proves that change is always bad. Stick to what you know every single time. I look, he's kind of hanging his head in shame again. Yeah, not as low as the last time. But he's slightly happy that he's made some progress, so he's, he's raised it a little bit. Panel star. Well, that's going to be the last one we get then, because the, you know, I'm going to have to pick the the star on the star selection screen. Just fuck off, just to be safe. Uh, and the other star on the star selection screen that we don't have is the wall kick one. So we'll get the secret star, get the wall kick one, then we'll get the panels. Saving the best for last, as always. It's like, does it need to be this long though? Like, it don't really answer because, because the answer is no. Right, I wonder actually, can you maybe like long jump to it from here? Uh, no, but I think I know what I'm gonna do, and it's very bad, and it's but it's still better than what I was thinking before, right? Watch this. Yeah. So if I just I... land here, you know what I'm gonna do, don't you? Mm-hmm. 
actually. That's exactly what you're gonna do. <laughs> this is so God, stupid. This is I'm, I'm doing it. So I'm doing it. I, I've, I've committed to it now. There's no way this is frame perfect. I've just got like f five or something, in, four or five in a row. Now that I've said that, the punishment must start. You know what? Save state. Like, let's not be daft about this. Oh my God. When the game gives you dumb shit, respond in kind. Yeah, that's very fair. That, not so much. Oh, for God's sake. Maybe it is frame perfect. Or more likely I'm literally just being punished for saying that I was doing well. Like, what's more likely? Probably that, right? Probably oh, supposed off to it. wall kick over that wall from the other side. Yeah, that's but... what I was planning to do originally, and yeah, that probably is what you're meant to do, but I feel like this... Well, I don't know if I'd say it's easier. Oh, wait a minute, can you just land on that? No, of course not. Why, why would you nope. be able to... Why? Although, I wonder actually if I can make this work. Probably not. That would just be too I easy. I think it's... No, it's... Because he's like um, perpendicular to the wall, he's not able to actually turn around and do the kick thing on it. He'd have to be slightly more inclined, so... Okay. Do a few more. Well, back to this then. Yep. The same way that we introduce every video. Welcome back to this. Oh my god. I actually, wouldn't mind hold on. seeing what it would look Can like I... if Mario's head was backwards while you were doing that. That would be funny as hell. Hmm. Yeah, maybe in the next one. No, that's not going to work, is it? Although I've managed to land here, although I don't know how helpful that is. Oh, can you send Mario to hell through there? Oh, I'm sending him to hell. Rip. Oh, that was a good one. Yeah. Right, can I make it now? Should be able to. Nope, maybe one more. Maybe one more. God. Okay, clearly it's a little bit further than I think it is. I thought oh, you would have. Oh, had hold that. on. No, it's okay. It's fine. I mean, it's not fine, but I have made it. Block is not even attached to it. Look at that. Why would it be? I've just had an idea, right? Let's see if I can do this. What I want to try and do is like kick. I have to yep. be under the star, but you know what I mean, right? Like the TTC thing. Yep. It has to mm. work. It it Just may. I don't there. actually know if it will. Usually they only work when the star's like very close to the ground. I'm not. Gonna, I'm, I'll try it one more time. Yeah. Screw it. Okay. Hmm, I was trying to dive there, didn't seem to want to do anything. Can I reach it from here? We're not going to find Back out. Backflip and ground pound, maybe? I mm, kind of want to do that, like just get under it and do that. Because <laughs> he's going to fall all the way down to the abyss. This is obviously completely pointless, right? And I'm going to try it one take, more time. He's going to be falling for fucking ages. Yeah, screw it. You know what? Just let him fall for ages. I don't even care. Still, actually, maybe that is as long as level 11, because that was quite the fall. Nicely skewed ahead there. The secret of the sky clock. So if you went in, like, you know, on the correct star, you would, like, presumably be able to anticipate that it was there. But... It shows you where the star spawns anyway, and you actually can't see it for once. It's not like behind a wall. Anyway, yeah. we'll get that wall kick one now. Yeah, so what we have to do first... Actually, what we have to do first is this. There. That's this is a wide angle. 
Good grief. I don't know if you can... Have no, I can't. Oh, Alright, okay, I thought you were going to say something like, I don't know if you can make it up from that. You might be able to get an angle slightly wider than it. Oh, come off it. I'm, I'm not used to it being this wide. It's throwing the timing off a little bit. Is he just on that note? Instead of going to the pipe and then wall kicking up, you probably could just wall kick to the top of this right away and then do that stupid um, thing again. In fact, nah. You'd still have I mean, to. You'd still you have, have to go most of the reason, distance. So. Yeah. I felt so empowered doing this section with the new steel ball. Like, I actually felt like. Yeah, it makes a difference. Definitely. Yeah, I definitely but, felt. Like I was, I could actually play. <laughs> it's like getting your first N64 controller again. You know, it just feels so new. I'm getting really fucked. Like I sick tried of this. this section when we were scoping the stage out originally. This was before I put in the steel ball, and uh, have to say, was not having a good time with that. No, we gave up pretty quickly, as I recall. This was immediately after we finished level 13, so like already we were in a bad mood. Right, let's just not be daft here. We've seen this before, we've made it across before. Some light safe state abuse is fine. It, this game is abusing our time and sanity, so... Correct. And also, abuse is even in the name for this one, so... That clearly means I'm allowed to abuse things like cheats. What else could it mean? I think it's a given. Yep. Right, safe state. Let's just put the camera this way for a change. No, it's definitely not. Unless I can do this and see. No. Alright, fine. At least I know where this is now. I think I'm going to have to go all the way up here again anyway. I bet there's a panel next to this star or near it. Would not be shocked in the slightest. Look at his head. <laughs> He's looking down, terrified. Honestly, fair. Let's grab one of these. That was a cursed ground pound with his head like that. Oh my god, that is really cursed. The long jumps are pretty great too. I think they're both pretty great. <laughs> His head's rolling. <laughs> Honestly, I've run make, out of things to say. I've... You've got to make your own fun. In this, oh, of course. Stage, but... It's in short supply in this game, so... It's a good thing that my mic's not picking this up, but I've been yawning constantly. Yep, that's completely <laughs> Since... fair. But it was just a little bit before we started looking for that last red coin. Well, I hate to break it to you, but there's still the bloody panel start to go, so... Try not to fall asleep during the call. No, oh, I'm not that tired. Just bored. You will be by the end of this, I bet, because it's probably going to take a while. Well, saying that, like, surely we know where everything is now, right? Surely. When I get to Hopefully. here, I can see if there's a panel. Bet there is. Well, there's a red coin, as we discovered, and I forgot and now remember. Yep. Yep. Of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? Why wouldn't there be exactly? So, there you go. It's, it's our fault for not expecting it. This seems very unforgiving, this bit. Did you give them like a triple jump? That have crossed it, the gap enough? Uh, maybe. I think he still would need to wall kick, but I, I will not be testing it, so we'll just leave that as a mystery for the ages. How unreasonable is it? That you no, it's fine. I'm just I'm zombie hovering up. It's, it's fine. Zombie hover up. It's not a problem. Like it's beyond unreasonable. They have to parkour back up to this fucking cloud just to get back in the stage. Like it. Yep. Couldn't be bothered to, you know, make you start outside the pipe or anything. 
that seven looks like a question mark without the dot yeah, at the bottom, does. doesn't it? I'm not going to do the camera thing here just in case I need Mario Cam. But first thing I'm going to check, is there one down here? No. Next thing I'm going to check, is there one up here? No. Is there one off to this side? Because it's entirely possible, you know. I wouldn't put it past no. them. Is there one on this side? We will find out one day. No. Okay, nope, good. One off to the side over there. What, on the side of the thing I'm wall kicking on? No, it's over by the loot right. puddles with the coin rings. Oh, that's fine, yeah. I know about that one. I'm surprised there isn't one just like really far down under the pipe. Like below the red coin. I actually am genuinely surprised about that. I, you know, since we know you put the red that coin there. That would be here. A, a, you know, a pretty typical place for one. For sure. Yep. Oh my god, this section though. Like, put yourself, for the moment, put yourself back in the mind state of yourself. Let's just say back in like 96, 97. Say this is the Mario game, the 3D Mario game you got with your brand new N64. Like, say you, you powered it on, and then 30 minutes or so you get to this stage. And that's how you make a PlayStation kid. <laughs> <laughs> I was lucky enough to have both. Same. So the weird thing is, I had. So my parents are divorced. Um, I didn't have a PlayStation at my mom's for at first, but we had one at my dad's, and I used to play it all the time. And um, I came home from visitation with my dad one weekend, and my parents had just bought a PlayStation. I don't know why. Because they're not... Neither one of my parents really care for gaming or anything like that. And my siblings, when they were younger, would play games with me, but as they got older, they stopped. I was the only nerdy one. So, like, I still to this day don't know why they bought it. And it was a quote-unquote family console that quickly just became mine, because I was the only one that played it. So, yeah. Don't question it. And I still have it. I still have it to this day. Does it still work? Yep, still in per I had to replace the controller port in port 1, but other than mm. that, it's still in perfect working condition. Very nice. Yeah, I think I've still yeah, got mine. I bought, I bought a pre-owned one that was in good condition from a local oh, independent shop. Finger puppet. And it had some other issues with it, but like... I inspected the controller ports and they were still basically flawless, so I just swapped out the controller ports and took the thing back and said it didn't work. <laughs> it's a shitty thing to do. But that I had a friend that worked. Yeah. Who I had cares? a friend that worked there and, and she was cool with it, so. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting that there. She took it back without question because it was me, so. Did you tell her the truth or did you just keep the lie going forever? <laughs> Oh, I told her after the fact. Ah, right, okay. Oh, yeah, of course, after you get your money back, obviously. My god. What? What just happened there? How was he so far out? Like, her and I and some other friends hung out, like, a day or so after, and I, I told her straight up. I kind of felt bad, and she didn't care, so... It was am I just, like, stupid or something? Like, how am I... How is this happening now? At this late hour? Apparently, you're just not greased up enough. Clearly, I need to disassemble my controller and meticulously grease every single part of it. Honestly, it's so satisfying when you do that though and it all comes together and it's just perfect chef's kiss. Yeah. Is there going to be one over here? It's entirely possible, so I need to check. I don't remember seeing one here, but... I don't either. It's, I know there's oh, there's three. I'm, I'm going to get them later, though. What I wanted to check was... If, oh, God's sake. If there's one <laughs> over here. Because I, I, I don't want to, like... I don't want to have to come back, you know? He says after... He doesn't look like it, and thank God for that. After already, like, going through the whole stage, like, three or four times at this point. Uh, don't see any here. I wonder if there's one just like on the goop. 
like on top of the wall. Doesn't look like it. So we'll just assume no. I'll be honest, I'm surprised. Hold I on, there's a one down here. No. That's totally why I fail, honestly. That would have been one of the first places that I would have thought a panel would be in this stage. Yeah. Like that cheeky one in level 8 that we missed that was just like off the ledge near the skull thing, remember? Yep. We've had bad luck with these panels in this hack. I think those yep. have been the worst ones for us. It's definitely luck and no one can prove otherwise. So... Now, is there one off the side of this? Let's try the triple jump method. It may actually work. Okay, it does. A little bit difficult to recover from, but at least we know it's possible. So there you go, we've learned something. Be helpful I've got to go back down and get run. those three panels over there. Okay, Great. can I just... It's pretty far away, this. I'll just land on this thing. Or not. I don't know why he didn't grab the ledge there. Oh, nope, apparently you just rather fucking die. Can I even, like... I can probably get back with some tremendous skewing. Like this. That was absurd. Clearly not what you meant to do. Oh. See, again, wasn't expecting it. Had to be punished. Punished for skill, as yep. always. Right, safe state here. Like, I don't know how noticeable it is, like, for people watching gameplay, but, like, with the steel ball and with the controller finely greased and all that, like, making minute movements, like, especially in the air like that, was so much easier. Yeah. It, it does make before. a difference. Like, I feel like I... my performance overall in this last episode was cut above. Yeah, so. I agree. I agree with that. Which is helpful because the next stage is like this times a hundred and a lot yeah. less forgiven. It's, it's bad. dog shit. And as I alluded to in the previous episode, the way that we get in there is something else, let's say. We'll, we'll cover that later on though. I don't want to give away too many details just yet because it's quite, quite the story. Must check every corner, must check off the ledge every time. Have I checked over here yet? I know this leads back to like an area where I was, but is there one down there? I don't think there is. I don't think there is either. You know what, let's just take the gamble. Can't wait for that to be the one that is there, and then we spend 40 minutes off screen looking for it. Yeah, this hack is going to ruin panel stars for me. Like, I'll be playing a, a nice casual hack. That's not even remote, anything remotely like this, and I'll see a panel star and just have immediate PTSD. Honestly, I already don't like them. I've never liked them. It's just boring. It's just secrets again, only slightly worse, isn't it? They're, they're very similar, yeah. They're not too far removed from secrets. And red coins. But at least red coins uh, give you, like, health and contribute towards 100 and so on. And also are in the base game. Secrets are too, of course. Well, not in this capacity. They're usually mm. done a little it, smarter than this. Yeah, they're in locations where you would expect to find them. Sort of. I mean, they are secrets at the end of the day. The first ones that come to mind are the ones in, like, wet, dry world and then tiny yeah. huge, because those were always in, those were in really good spots. Or the pyramid and shift and sand land. Yeah. A shitty stage overall, like all deserts. Don't know why they continue to be in games. Well, I feel like we've gone through that area pretty extensively. I haven't seen anything else. I haven't either. I'm going to check behind these again, because you never know if one's going to just be on this star. God, and you still got to do that horrendous wall kick section too. Again. Yep. Go so around every fucking star. Yep. Well, you know. It's our fault for agreeing to do it, clearly. I would have just levitated up from that. <laughs> no accepting that. I, I, 
I could, but I feel like I've set this ridiculous restriction in my mind, which I haven't vocalised until now, which is like, I'm happy to do levitate to, to find things, but then I must get them legitimately. He says, abusing save states every two seconds. <laughs> best, best not to think about it. Invisible wall. I'll check the bottle again. I don't think there was one there, but... <sighs> yeah, I don't think there was one there either. Like, I'm not getting, like, well, frustrated I... with this the way I was in some of the previous stages, but, like, I'm... I, I'll be honest, I'm getting fucking bored. Same. I've been bored for a while. Yeah, no same, why. honestly. Like, it, it literally is duplication of work. But yeah, I I don't think there's one by that bottle, but I feel I don't think so safe either, checking but because same. this you is one of those know. games where making assumptions definitely makes an ass out of you and me. Correct. And if you have the gall to apply logic to your assumptions, then you're in the wrong game, son. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's everything on the less shitty of the two shitty parts of this stage. Yeah, I just have a quick look down here just in case if I can stop getting invisible. Yeah, I don't think there is anything else. So I need to get back to that pipe now. Oh nice, I built up a little bit of speed there. Uh... Well, actually, this kind of works, because now I need to go over this way anyway, so I can check if there's one down there. There's definitely not one at the section below me. Come off it, really? I don't think <sighs> there is, and I would really hate it if there was. I don't so. think there is either, but... I need to go this way anyway, to get to where the pipe is. Yeah, because we've already done this bit, haven't we, and there wasn't anything... Well, there were, but we got them. I'll check on top of that thump in a minute. I think I've probably already looked there, but... Man, I don't even know anymore. <laughs> Everything just looks the same again. We've been everywhere too many times. Okay, there isn't one there. So where's the pipe again? It's just on the other side of this. Yep. Okay. So, we only saw two panels on this thing, right? So, hopefully that's all I of them. I think so. I can only recall to... I shudder to think of where this star is going to appear. That's assuming it does appear after these two. If this isn't the case and we can't immediately see where the next one is, I'm safe stating. I'll probably just off screen it to be honest. Fair. I mean, the so one safe are... assumption you can make about where the star is going to be is nowhere good. Probably miles away from where I am. Actually, that's part of the challenge. Yeah, of course. Well, what else could we do? Nice backflip, thanks for that Mario. Appreciate it, homie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not crazy about this angle. I think I might just make a, a pit stop in here. In fact... Yeah, that was uh, that was quite the crusty angle. Yeah, it was. Now, these walls are a lot closer together, I wasn't expecting that, even though I've been here several times already. So there's a panel there, that's one of the ones that we know about, and the other one's at the very back. So unless we can see one, just you'd be able to see it jutting out if it was in one of these openings. So it's probably not there. Okay, I'm lined up with that.
can we see another one in this section? I know there's that one behind it. That's I think that's the, the last one. I know one. Of. It's the only one I can Has think of. It has to be. Has to be. If we you lived know, in a fair world, it would be a lack. I have the no more eyes. I, the more I think about it, the more I'm glad we decided to do this on the actual star. Because if it was like the other stage, I know and the star the, just won't spawn until you're on this star like that. No, the risk was that, unacceptable. That would be an ex yeah, that would be an acceptable rage quit, to be honest. Yeah, but again, you know, we're, we're definitely past the point of no return with that. Like the, the game's getting finished, no matter what, at this point. Regardless of how sick of it we are, which is very. Although I must say, this stage hasn't been nearly as bad as I expected. It's, it's been all right. Course eleven in that. Oh my God. Uh, oh my God. Thank you. Don't know where Where's the star, the star is. Where's the star? Where's the fucking star? Oh, okay, safe state going down. I am going to check the levitate where it is, just in case it's like in this area. It seemed like it was spawning pretty far from here, but. Let's just and also kinda see. high. Now can you see it? I can see it. it's on the books. See it? Wait, no, oh, is yeah. it or is that a block? No, that's just the block. Yeah, clearly I am blind. Oh, it's on the bottle. See it? Oh yeah. Yeah, okay. Well I guess we're getting there then. Through the second pipe. Okay, yeah, that was fair. Yeah, this stage wasn't too bad. For a stage like, that's like, like clearly a, a bit of a challenge stage, like, you know, I've seen worse. The next I mean, level's a it, lot it, worse. It's still dog shit. It's still bad. Yeah. But like, not nearly as egregious as, like, Force 11, 13, that fucking awful Bowser stage. The Bowser stage, yeah, like, really, it was just the boss that took that to the next level. I could handle the rest of it. But the I mean, your hands was... were going out doing that fucking platforming. I know. Fucking whole body's about to go out in a minute. If this continues. Where is the bloody pipe? Imagine, is it like miles above where I am? It must be. It has to be. Oh my god. Can we... Do? Right, this'll do. This is fine. There it is. There it is. Uh, we're almost done. Not with this hack, just with this stage. Twenty-three stars to go after this. Mm, need to do this bit again. This is so riveting the last twenty times. Nope. Like, you can mitigate so much of these courses' bullshit by not making you repeat the same goddamn thing over and over again. I know. I know. Like, that would go such a long way. They'd still be bad, but God, can you at just... least it wouldn't be so boring. Yeah, I mean, boredom... Like, a, a boring stage is worse than a hard stage most of the time, you know? I think so anyway. It's it's the biggest crime that I get. That's why I hate DK64. Because it's boring. It's a boring game for boring people. There, I said it. I, I kind of find it boring too. Like, even and I need to acknowledge that, I yeah, think. obviously, I've done a series on it, two series on it actually. One of them will never so, see the light of day. Well, no, I didn't even mean that. Like, I meant like the Zero Golden Bananas run. Oh, yeah. Like, that, was, that was technically a second series. So clearly I must be a boring person then, because I, I spent a lot of time on that game. I mean, where I am I like going? Where am I, where am I actually going? What am I doing? That really is a question well, for the ages. I feel like with glitches and doing those like that zero banana run, that kind of makes it somewhat worth it, like it's at least more entertaining, but like... It is the first couple of times, or maybe even just the first time honestly, but even that bores me now. I know the glitches and... I incorporate them into my yearly playthrough of that game. Yes, I know I've said that before, but yep, just a reminder. I despise the game, and yet every year I go on a pilgrimage to collect every banana. 
Make it make sense, please. <laughs> All right. We're done. We're done with this stage. Forever. And I'll prove it in a second. Oh. I'm surprised you went and got the rest of those. I thought you'd leave at least one more for me. Just kidding. Can't prove it because we're not in a hub. Let's exit the hub. Or let's exit to the hub. There. Done. It's done. We're done. We're not going in there again. It's fine. Everything's fine. And you can't prove it's not. That's it for this one. We'll see you in the next one. See you in the next one.